amount of fishing with night crawlers, you know that your success varies somewhat from time to time. Sometimes you go out and the fish uh, seem to bite on every cast. Other times they just don't seem to be interested. A lot of anglers attribute that to things like weather conditions, uh, maybe water clarity, water temperature, things like that. And those certainly play a part, but trust me, I've been doing this for a long time, and the most important thing when it comes to night crawler fishing is how does a worm taste? A fresh worm tastes a whole lot different to the fish than one that's been in the refrigerator for a long time. So you're probably asking, how do you figure that out? How do you know whether the worms you have taste good? And the simple answer to that question is, go ahead and taste one. Now I realize those of us that have grown up in Western countries cringe at the thought of that, but believe me, there's plenty of people all over the world that don't have any problem eating worms. Now, I suggest you at least just eat the front part of the worm because the back part has like the intestines in it. And trust me, that doesn't taste good, but the front part really isn't too bad. So I'm gonna tear off the back part here and go ahead and give this a shot. Not too bad at all. These are fresh worms. Um, these have been old ones that have been in the refrigerator for a while. They have kind of a bitter taste, but these really don't taste bad. I know it's hard to believe. The only way you're gonna find out is to give it a try for yourself. Very good. So if you're fishing with night crawlers, the thing to remember is keep the worms fresh and you'll have plenty of success. Hopefully you found this useful. If you're um, going out fishing soon this spring, I want to wish everybody a very happy April Fool's Day. And if you want to learn how to make delicious, authentic looking jello worms, uh, take a look in the comments below. I'll post the link to the recipe. And lastly, if you've enjoyed this video, please click that like button, comment, and share it with your friends. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.